everyone it's Catherine and you are going to get sick of seeing this manicure by the end of this week because I've been doing a lot of recording today. This is my last video to record uh, but it's the only one that I'm drinking for because you know I'm rewarding myself for getting all my artist nails recorded, essence, all that kind of thing. You're, you're getting a video every day this week. I am in, re enjoying a sugar-free tonic and Mm -mm. a boils gin from Aldi really really love that boils gin so um yeah let me know actually if you can get that in the UK because I'd be interested to know if it's just an Irish gin or what, what's going on I know it's an Irish gin but if it's only available in Ireland okay rambling um a couple of weeks ago I was a little bit drunk one evening of an evening and I don't know if I was feeling sorry for myself or if I got overly excited, but I decided to order something, um, probably because they delivered to Switzerland and I got excited in my drunken state. But yeah, I've ordered a subscription box. Luckily, it's just for the month. I've torn my um, address off. I'm gonna open it up. It is for the love of polish. I am ridiculously excited about this um, because I've never had anything like this before. Um, it's Polish for Days and Polish. They're the two brands. Um, I think there's another one in here, but we'll see. There's a guest one in here somewhere, I think. And yeah, very excited about this. Um, oh, look at the packaging. I feel like whenever I watch like the Me Box unpacking, or unboxing with uh, Nika and when Claire used to do it, I got very jealous. And now I get to do it. Okay, let's see what's in here. Ooh, this is, oh, I'm glad I wait for the gin. This is so pretty. Okay, so I've got three polishes in here. So let's put them out and see. This is really well packaged, actually. Very pretty. Okay, let's get rid of the box. Okay, so this will be my first polish for days and my first polish polish. <laughs> oh, look at this. This is stunning. This lives up to the pictures. It's a grey base with a purple uh, shimmer and then a scattered holographic. Oh, so beautiful. This is called The Final Countdown. I think it was an 80s theme. That is really, really pretty. So I'll swatch that in a second. Then we have this one. It seems like they've all been packaged up separately because they're slightly different in their packaging. <gasps> oh, look at this. Another purple holographic for me. This looks like a duochrome. This is shifting from, actually a multi-chrome. This is shifting from a magenta color, purple, uh, to a teal. And then there's like a flash of gold in there. But that may not translate to the nails, but there is a beautiful color shift. And then there is a flaky in there, a silver flaky by the looks of things, and a holographic to this is called Karma Chameleon. Oh my God, that's so funny. Ma'am, if you're watching, you can um, you can confirm this story. This is the song that I used to sing, this Boy George song. I used to sing it when I was a kid and I, I think I would drive her crazy with this song. Um, so ma'am, you can comment and everybody will see your comment. You can confirm that that's true. Um, I absolutely adored that song. So perfect 80s polish. And I am an 80s baby, so there you go. And then the final one is this. So let's see, this is the surprise, I guess. Oh, it's a blush lacquers. It's my second blush lacquer. Oh yes, I loved the one that I got uh, from um, Color for Nails. Oh, this is Synthwave Diva. Oh gosh, I'm loving the colours. These are exactly my colour schemes. Oh, you know, I, I'm so pleased with these three polishes that I'm very tempted to get this box again, even though it's ridiculously expensive for me. I think it's like 50 francs or something, but they're beautiful. I suppose not that bad when, when you work out the cost per polish and shipping and all that. This is a purple, um, This it looks to be a purple, Glitter um, base, yeah, purple or blackened base. It's a blackened base, maybe with a shifting 
purple to gold um, pink shimmer, I think. We'll have to figure it out. And then there's a flaky in there as well. Some sort of multi-chrome flaky. Beautiful. Oh, okay, let's get a wheel and let's swatch these bad boys. Okay, so we have a wheel. Let's start with the polish one. The final countdown, absolutely beautiful. So uh, that's quite a sizable bottle as well. That's cool. Um, I'm very excited. Let's zoom you in a little bit. Uh, I'll, zoom, I'll bring it up to you rather than zooming in because that never really works, does it? Very, very um, opaque. Very sparkly on that first coat. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, it'll probably take two to three coats. But you can definitely see that shimmer there already. At least I hope you can. I can. It's really, really pretty. <gasps> so excited. Okay. Has anyone else got any... Or are there subscription bo boxes that you like to use? This is polished for days. I love the packaging on this. This is so cute. And this is Karma Chameleon. Oh, so in love. The teal and purple. This kind of... It's a, It's almost a fuchsia. And the... the Lakey's in here. Whew. This is really, really pretty. I'm going to try and rehaul the way I swatch. That's my goal. Um, I think I'm going to do more face to face stuff and then maybe swatch either on a stick or on my nail. It depends on how much time I have, but that is really pretty. That's again, that's going to take two or three coats, but still, it is a multi chrome, so that's to be expected. I hope you can see that teal. It's really strong and um, it's really strong in person. And then finally we have blush lacquers. This is so pretty. And this is Synthwave Diva. Yeah, it looks to be a blackened base. Just give you the brush shot there. It looks to be a blackened base with a duochrome glitter shimmer in there. And uh, yeah, oof, that is stunner runers. And uh, they complement each other perfectly, the three of them. They really do complement each other very well. And the formulas seem really good. So that's a blackened base with a gold pink shifting uh, glitter in there, micro glitter. And then we've got these uh, flakies. I don't think I got many of the big flakies out, but I got a few out in that first coat. All right, guys and girls, I'm going to have another sip of gin, try and calm down and do a second and third coat where needed. Okay, so I am back with a second and third coat where needed. The first one we have here is Polishes, um, the final countdown, and that only needed a second coat. So there you can see, it's so beautiful. The um, shimmer is really, really strong in that. Uh, you can't see the holographic in my ring light, as usual, um, but it is there. The one beside that is probably my favourite of the three, um, although I love all of them. And this is Karma Chameleon from Polished for Days. Just look at the flaky in there. It's so beautiful. This took three coats, but worth it. Love it. And then finally, this is so unusual. This one from uh, Blush Lacquers. And this is Synthwave Diva and yeah that blackened base is really really pretty. I think that's gonna look cool um, in a when we have a let's see if we can bring a little bit more light for you so you can capture that glittery goodness. So so pretty. Love it, love it, love it. They're really I'm really really happy with them really happy with the service I will probably get it again and um, although next time I'll be sober when ordering them I'm sure so yeah they were that was the for the love of polish box and um, really happy with them and yeah I hope you enjoyed the rest of the videos this week let me know if there's a subscription box that you get whether it's polish or something else I'm really interested to know um because I'm limited in what I can get here in Switzerland so it was a nice treat to get this 
um, yeah, let me know in the comments what you think and if there's something that you'd recommend in terms of subscription, at least then other viewers can maybe find out through your comments what they can look out for. I know Mebox is a big one in the UK. Uh, okay, that is it. That is my 80s For the Love of Polish box. Unfortunately, I don't know if, I don't think these polishes are available outside of the subscription service, but you can go and check out um, the, you can go and check out the, the little, the Instagram page and the Polish for Days website for more information. And yeah, I think I'll be using it again. All right, everybody. I'll talk to you again soon. Talk to you again tomorrow, actually, with Narda's nails. Although I am finished recording now, so I'm going to go enjoy my gin. See you all soon. Bye.